Hamilton and Verstappen, Verstappen and Hamilton wheel to wheel going into the field of the Temporal Chicane. Hamilton is forced wide and he's lost a little bit of bodywork as well. Verstappen leads the Emilia Romagna Grand Prix. Oh, and sliding off the road goes the Mercedes of Lewis Hamilton. Oh, and I is. think he might be, unless he can find reverse and he's kept the engine running, this is absolute disaster for Lewis Hamilton. And we're going to get a safety car now because that's Valtteri Bottas and George Russell who are out of this race. What was he doing? Honestly, is he a f for what? The race has now been red flagged. Lando Norris is wasting no time whatsoever getting stuck into the racing. He's got past Charles Leclerc and up in the second place. Who's got the DRS this time? Lewis Hamilton is back up into the podium places. Is Hamilton close enough? And he does look to be an awful lot closer. And once again, Norris makes him go the long way round, but Hamilton was close enough. Uh, it's too quick for me. To a man who's never won in Italy before and who wins the Emilia Romagna Grand Prix this afternoon. Max Verstappen, for the first time in his career, takes victory in Italy, and it was a victory by a long, long margin. The team getting it all right, these are the guys that need to get it. Yeah, this is it, but so does Pierre. As Pierre stated, he's been qualifying brilliantly this year. It's just Sunday that they need to pull it all together. But they've got a car here that can fight for fifth in the Constructors' Championship. And it's not the season that Aston Martin were expecting. They were expecting to finish third this season. They were expected to be in there just underneath the top two cars. And they need, now need to readjust their expectations for the season. Uh, McLaren, are they punching above where they expected to be? They are above where they thought they were going to be at this point of the year. Lando's really trying to keep a lid on it at the moment. There's something different about him this year, I think. Lewis is saying, that the Red Bulls are inevitably favourites this season. But Red Bull is saying that's just tactics. You're putting that on us so that we we have the pressure. You saying that we're the favourites puts the pressure on us. But are they the favourites?